Some of my favorite places are not very well frequented by others. all about bright colors and crazy looking images that you don't normally see. And you can really do go crazy with light painting. crazy different colored lights and I could tell that it wasn't manipulated by Photoshop it was it was done differently and somehow they were doing it with long exposures The Twin Cities brightest, uh, Dana Malby. He very much got me started, and uh, when he saw that I was from the same hometown as him and that I was interested in a few things that he liked, he invited me out to do a couple adventures with him, and, uh, and uh, that really opened up my mind, I guess. Iowa, that's where I started out working on my long exposure photos. Is, I just noticed there was uh, some open tunnels and started exploring down there with flashlights and, and uh, it was a pretty fun place to just go crazy. The largest lake in the United States, frozen over out about 100 feet. So we went out there and <laughs> took pictures and that's always what I'm, what I'm uh, I think, drawn to is places that haven't been explored and haven't been seen by the, the normal person. Crap of the air stuff.